What we expect? What can we expect from Kazuchika Okada, who just made his debut in AEW? A lot of fans are hyped about him, but I'm gonna tell you who is not hyped about him. Let's look at Kazuchika Okada from the perspective of a fan. From the perspective of a fan who doesn't know what this means. Yeah, I see a guy who is making a huge pop at Revolution, coming out the Young Bucks. Possibly their new business partner, possibly part of the elite, possibly part of that heel group that, that is dominating. No, nope, they just lost from Sting. But anyway, that doesn't really matter. They, were, they made a great send-off to Sting and I really appreciate this Young Bucks. Thank you. But besides that, what can we expect from Kazuchika Okada from the perspective of me? To be fair with you, I don't know. The only thing I know from Kazuchika Okada is nothing different from Will Ospreay. He was main eventing Tokyo Dome with Kenny Omega and last year he injured Brian Danielson while he was making his cuffed finisher. But what else can we expect from him? People were really hyped to see Kazuchika Okada in Revolution, but on the Dynamite next week, they were not so hyped to see him. And I fear that his hype is gonna fade off with the time. It's gonna be like, hype, 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 hype. Because honestly, I don't see anything special in him so far. I'm not sure if I should see something special in him, but so far, I don't see anything. Maybe AEW should replay some parts of best matches in order for me to start appreciating that guy. But so far, I don't see anything than a scuffed finisher. What is this finisher? You're hugging someone from behind and after that you're pulling his one arm and you're doing clothesline? What is this finisher? You can just call it the clothesline instead of rainmaker. How are you making a rain with that finisher? Huh? I don't know. I didn't want this video to be a Kazuchika Okada hate video. I just wanted to share my concern about the guy. I feel like he needs to step up his game in order to start, in order for people to start caring about him. I don't know how he's gonna do it. I don't know what is his skill set. I don't know what is his disposing. I feel like he was one of the biggest stars in Japan. But honestly, I feel like that doesn't mean anything because Mercedes Monet was a champ. She's a little bit like nobody right now, unless she goes back to WWE and she is Sasha Banks, right? So I feel like every pro wrestling fan probably will come at me and will fight me if I say the Japan is shit place to be a pro wrestler. But tell me one top tier guy in the industry who came from Japan. Just tell me one, not two, not three, not five. That's what I'm trying to say. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'm gonna see you next time. Peace.